So thanks to 30 billion kilowatts of unmetered electricity and about a ton of rain, we ended up sharing the same barn. Thank you. Don't mention it. You know, this is really, really great. You know that? It's almost funny. I think this is funny. Yeah. I mean, you grow up next door to someone, and you figure you really know them. And then, like, overnight, you find out you, you didn't know them at all. Yeah, well, look who's talking. Me? Yeah, I'm not the one who changed. You really believe that? You bet. I mean, changed a little, but not really, you know. But I guess I knew better. I guess we both knew better. It just took Winnie to say it. Here's what I think. I think this had to happen. Today, tomorrow. Someday. I mean, it's not like we're kids anymore. Everybody grows up. It's not like Peter Pan or something. Peter Pan. It's just... Somehow I thought we'd be together, you know? Yeah. Together forever. Get me to death. <laughs> Can you believe that?
Once upon a time, there was a girl I knew who lived across the street. Brown hair, brown eyes. When she smiled, I smiled. When she cried, I cried. Every single thing that ever happened to me that mattered, in some way, had to do with her. That day, Winnie and I promised each other that, no matter what, that we'd always be together. It was a promise full of passion and truth and wisdom. It was the kind of promise that can only come from the hearts of the very young. <laughs>